Welcome to the introduction to Indosoft Web Studio and CE View. This presentation is divided in specific sections. First of all, we provide a brief overview about the company and the history of Indosoft. Then we present the company's vision, which defines the mission of the company in the market. Afterwards, we describe the main technologies and unique advantages of Indosoft Web Studio. Finally, we discuss important characteristics of the product itself. The presentation is concluded with a product demo, where the features aforementioned are demonstrated in action. You can navigate through specific topics of the presentation using the menu at the left side or jump to any part using the standard controls at the bottom of the video. Feel free to jump into sections that you are more interested in. However, we recommend taking the time to watch the entire presentation because the concepts described in each section complement each other. We appreciate your attention and we sincerely hope that you enjoy the presentation. Indosoft is a private held company founded in the United States back in 1997. The company staff has a solid experience in industrial automation, instrumentation, embedded systems, and information technology. Mr. Ernest Rowland, CEO and co-founder, accumulates more than 30 years of experience in this industry. Indosoft has been the pioneer in key technologies releasing, for example, the first human-machine interface software for the Microsoft Windows CE operating system, called Indosoft CE View. Back in 1997, it was extremely challenging to provide a functional HMI for Windows CE due to the limitations of the earlier versions of this operating system and the hardware available for it. However, the investments in R&D to create a runtime HMI compatible with the earlier versions of this platform paid back years later when the hardware evolved and Windows CE became a true standard for embedded devices. The optimization implemented in CE View sets it apart from the competitors, even today. Indosoft CE View is, without a doubt, the most functional and optimized HMI software for Windows CE. Indosoft has pioneered again, releasing one of the first web-based HMI SCADA software in the market. The solution released years ago has evolved into a complete, fully functional, easy to deploy, flexible, and above all secure solution to visualize the graphic interface from remote thin clients. Indosoft has been a Microsoft Gold certified partner for years. It is the, the highest level of partnership that an independent software vendor can have with Microsoft. Among the benefits, Indosoft has access to the Microsoft operating systems and products even before they are released to the market. Therefore, Indosoft is able to test and adapt its products to the new Microsoft platforms, even before they are available to users. Indosoft has won several awards during the past years, including the Frost & Sullivan's 2005 Entrepreneurial Company of the Year, Control Engineering's Engineers 2006 Choice Award for HMI Software, and the 2007 European Frost and Sullivan Award for Product Innovation in Europe. It is worth mentioning that Indosoft Web Studio Control Engineers Award was based on a pool conducted with the actual leaders. Indosoft has established offices worldwide. The headquarters is in Austin, Texas, USA. Indosoft keeps offices also in Brazil and Germany to support local markets and contribute to the strategy of the company. In addition to the corporate offices, 
Indisoft has built an extensive network of distributors, system integrators, partners, and OEMs around the world in more than 100 countries. Indisoft's business model is based on a strong technical base, which keeps developing and evolving the product with cutting edge technologies while relying on its partners to distribute the product in the market. Indisoft's product has proven to be a perfect fit for hardware manufacturers or control system providers that want to integrate a human machine interface software to their products, resulting in an integrated and flexible solution to the end user. This model has enabled Indisoft to offer a product extremely competitive not only commercially, but also technically. Indisoft has grown its sales consistently above 40% per year, validating this model and the acceptance of the product in the market. Since its foundation, Indisoft's vision has been to provide a user-friendly, integrated development environment for deployment of applications for data acquisition and visualization of key performance indicators, process information, or machine data with the power of the internet across a world of devices. This vision has been incorporated in the product, which provides several features in an intuitive interface, such as wizards, templates, context-sensitive help, and IntelliSense, among others. The development environment is truly integrated. Instead of forcing the user to install, configure, integrate, purchase, and license independent add-ons for different features, such as database integration, thin clients, alarm online, alarm history, trend online, trend history, recipes, reports, scheduler, VB script, OPC client server, redundancy, communication drivers, and so forth, Indisoft has proven to be generic enough to be successfully deployed in different vertical markets for data acquisition, visualization of KPIs, process information, or machine data, yet efficient enough to create customized applications for each of these segments. Furthermore, the built-in thin client solution takes advantage of the existing infrastructure, whether it is a local area network, dial-up connection, or even internet. Finally, Indisoft provides an impressive level of portability, allowing the user to deploy applications on any device powered with an operating system currently supported by Microsoft. The strategy to accomplish the company's vision was to design a product based on standards and open architecture, which is able to retrieve or send any data, such as control commands, process readings, database history data, and so forth, through any network, such as Ethernet, Profibus, Ethercat, DeviceNet, and others, and make this information available on any device powered with an operating system currently supported by Microsoft. However, flexibility is offered on top of a solid base created with security in mind, supporting firewalls, encrypted data, and authentication. Indisoft designed many features to provide competitiveness, productivity, and cost management for its customers and for the end users. This slide outlines a sample of features that provide the benefits aforementioned. Support for all operating systems currently supported by Microsoft provides a high level of flexibility and portability when the user wants or needs to change the hardware platform but does not want to redesign the application. The remote diagnostic tools, remote engineering tools, and online configuration allow the Indisoft users to develop, 
maintain, or debug the application from remote development stations. Moreover, it is not necessary to shut down the runtime when implementing changes on the fly, even from a remote station, increasing the availability of the system. Finally, the application programming interfaces provided by Indisoft allow its integration to any other proprietary system. Applications created with Indisoft Web Studio can be deployed on any device powered with Windows mobile devices, such as PDAs or cell phones, and bring the information and the control literally to the end user, wherever he or she is, in real time. Indisoft created a state-of-the-art integration to any SQL relational databases, such as SQL Server, Oracle, Sybase, MySQL, Microsoft Access MDB files, and others. Indisoft has a patent pending on this solution, based on TCP IP over ADO.net. This solution enables users to integrate the application to databases, even without the knowledge of SQL language or any programming. You just need to follow the wizards to create a connection with the database. This integration enables the development of applications for real-time performance management, OEE, reports, and statistical information. Indisoft also provides a complete alarm module which handles online alarms, history of alarms, and can even send email notifications automatically based on alarm triggers. With all these features, Indisoft Web Studio is the most cost-efficient tool in the market for its segment as a direct consequence of the business model. In addition to that, the integrated development environment and the thin client solution represent significant cost savings not only on the licenses, but also on the indirect cost to develop, deploy, and maintain the application. Indisoft Web Studio offers the unique advantage to provide a single integrated development environment, which allows you to create an application which can be deployed on any device from any manufacturer, as long as it is powered with an operating system currently supported by Microsoft. This includes mobile devices like PDAs or cell phones running Windows Mobile, industrial panels running Windows CE or Windows XP embedded, workstation PCs running Windows XP or Windows Vista, and server stations running Windows 2003 Server or Windows 2008 Server. Indisoft supports all these platforms as long as the minimum system requirements are met. Even though applications created with Indisoft Web Studio are platform independent, as long as the device is running an operating system currently supported by Microsoft, Indisoft created a comprehensive license model that fits budgets proportional to the size of the project. Each bullet in this slide represents a license level, known as product type. It is important to clarify that Indisoft Web Studio is an integrated product, and the different product types represent only different license levels. This chart represents the difference between the product types, which are the license levels. Each product type limits the maximum number of tags that can be handled by the application, and the maximum number of communication drivers that can run simultaneously for the same application. Each tag represents an independent value holder, such as temperature, pressure, switch state, and so forth. Tags created in the application are counted for licensing purposes, regardless of whether they are linked to physical addresses of remote devices, such as PLCs. Each communication driver implements a protocol. The same driver can be used to communicate with several devices simultaneously as long as they support the same protocol and as long as they are connected to the HMI station through the same physical interface, for example, an Ethernet adapter. 
If you purchase a license for a specific product type, and eventually you need to upgrade the license for a higher level because the project evolved, adding additional tags or communication drivers, you only pay the price difference between the current level and the next level. You do not have to worry about the platform where the application will be deployed, or even the processor type of the hardware platform, as long as it is running on an operating system currently supported by Microsoft, providing unbeatable portability to projects created within the software. Since all major features are supported on all platforms, even small applications running in mobile devices can provide a rich integration and functionality to the user. The different license levels accommodate different budgets proportional to the size of the project. Finally, the thin client solution flows the information through different devices connected to the network. The IndieSoft solution has been deployed on many different industries, including oil and gas, building automation, automotive, instrumentation, warehouse management, water and wastewater, machinery, pharmaceutical, and many others. Every single screenshot in this slide illustrates a real-world application developed with Indisoft Web Studio. Even though it is a small sample of the thousands of applications deployed with the product, it shows the scalability of the Indisoft solution, supporting mobile devices, local HMI panels, desktop-based systems, all the way up to redundant server-based systems handling hundreds of thousands of points. Microsoft is a well-established and proven solution, having sold more than 20,000 licenses directly and many more indirectly through its partners and OEMs. You can access several case studies from successful real-world applications deployed in different vertical markets from the Indisoft website at www.indisoft.com. The development interface of Indisoft Web Studio is a rapid application development environment. Indisoft Web Studio is designed to be configured instead of programmed, allowing you to create interfaces based on knowledge of the process or machine to be monitored. You do not have to be a programmer to design applications with Indisoft Web Studio. Even sophisticated interfaces like database integration are accomplished through wizards that do not require programming skills. Indisoft provides communication drivers and OPC interface to exchange data with external devices such as PLCs, motion controllers, robots, and so forth. The data can be manipulated, stored, analyzed, and displayed through a rich graphic interface, not only to the local users, but also to remote users. The Indisoft Thin Client Solution allows remote users to access the application from computers or mobile devices, such as PDAs and cell phones, using, for example, Internet Explorer. It is not required to install the product, the application, or the license on the thin client stations. Furthermore, Indisoft Web Studio provides a set of tools to configure, deploy, or troubleshoot the application remotely. In addition to the interface with the external devices, Indisoft Web Studio can also save and retrieve data from any SQL relational database that supports ADO or ODBC, such as Microsoft SQL Server, Oracle, MySQL, Sybase, Microsoft Access MDB files, and others. 
Combining these features, Indisoft Web Studio can be used not only as a simple human-machine interface of SCADA software, but also to bridge the gap between the plant floor, where you have the controllers, and the enterprise, where you have the ERP systems based on databases, such as Microsoft Dynamics or SAP. Indisoft Web Studio is based on open technologies to provide a wide range of connectivity to you when integrating the product to different controllers, databases, and platforms. Indisoft Web Studio provides the functionality expected from a solid and complete SCADA system, but in a user-friendly and intuitive interface to reduce the time to develop, deploy, and maintain the application. Indisoft Web Studio provides an open architecture, which enables you to integrate it to different systems. Indisoft Web Studio developed more than 240 communication drivers for different protocols, including the PLCs from the major manufacturers and standard protocols, such as Modbus, DeviceNet, Profibus, BACnet, among others. In addition to the native communication drivers, which are installed along with the product, Indisoft Web Studio provides a built-in OPC client module capable of exchanging data with external devices through a third-party OPC server. In the Indisoft solution, OPC is not imposed, but rather supported. The system integrator has the freedom to use either a native communication driver the OPC interface, or even both solutions simultaneously, depending on the architecture of the system. Indisoft is continuously developing new communication drivers for emerging protocols. However, based on the modularity of the communication driver's interface, where each driver is basically a DLL file, you can develop new drivers by yourself using the driver toolkit. It is an application programming interface, which allows anyone with C or C++ skills to develop new communication drivers for Indisoft Web Studio and include the proprietary drivers in the project. Indisoft provides also another API called Tags Database Access Toolkit, which allows you to read or write values to any tag configured in the application. These APIs demonstrate the high level of openness of the Indisoft Web Studio architecture, allowing you to integrate your project even to proprietary systems. Indisoft Web Studio is able to save and retrieve data in extensible markup language and to exchange data with SQL relational databases through ADO or ODBC. Indisoft Web Studio supports also dynamic data exchange. Even though DDE is an old technology, Indisoft keeps it in the product due to its commitment to keep compatibility with applications created in previous versions of the product. Indisoft Web Studio provides also the TCP IP client and server modules to exchange data between two or more stations running Indisoft Web Studio applications. These modules can be used to implement redundant systems. The communication is based on events triggered by change of value, optimizing the usage of the network and increasing the performance. Indisoft Web Studio also provides a built-in OPC server allowing communication with third-party systems with an OPC client. It enables you to easily integrate into Soft Web Studio with legacy systems deployed with other HMI SCADA packages. Indisoft Web Studio also provides gateways for communication with InTouch from Wonderware and iFix from Schneider, regardless of any OPC configuration. Finally, after deploying the application and exchanging data with different systems, you can access the information not only locally, but also remotely through thin client stations. 
Indisoft Web Studio supports two types of thin clients, web thin clients and secure viewer thin clients. Web thin clients use a standard web browser, Internet Explorer, as the host for the application. It does not require installation of any software on the thin client station, and it is ideal for access from any device, such as computer, PDA, cell phone, etc in a local area network or a wide area network. The Secure Viewer Thin clients use the Secure Viewer software as the host for the application instead of using a web browser. The Secure Viewer displays the application in full screen mode and allows you to lock the user on the application based on username and password, locking commands to close the application or switch to the desktop such as Alt-Tab. In either solution, Indisoft Web Studio, the application, and the license are installed only on the server station, decreasing the significantly the cost to deploy and maintain the system. Both the server and the thin clients can run on any operating system currently supported by Microsoft, including Windows Mobile, Windows XP or Vista, or Windows 2003 or 2008 server. The maximum number of web thin clients and the maximum number of secure viewer thin clients supported simultaneously by the server are controlled by the license installed on the server. Indisoft Web Studio provides built-in features to support redundant servers, so the thin clients switch automatically to the secondary server if the primary server becomes unavailable for any reason. In addition to that, Indisoft offers the Studio Mobile Access Solution, where you can visualize tag values and alarms from any mobile device with a web browser, such as iPhone, BlackBerry, and others. Indisoft Web Studio running on mobile devices supports the same architectures supported when running it on regular PCs. When using the standalone solution, Indisoft CE View is installed on the mobile device, along with its license and the application files. During the runtime, Indisoft CE View can exchange data with external devices using the infrastructure for communication available such as Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, RFID, infrared, and so forth. Eventually, if applicable, CEV can even push the collected data into a remote database. When using the thin client solution, the mobile device just runs Internet Explorer or the web thin client solution, or Indisoft Secure Viewer or the Secure Viewer thin client solution. The mobile device connects to a remote station running Indisoft Web Studio and exchanges data with it using a TCP IP link, usually through a wireless Wi-Fi connection. It demonstrates the flexibility of the Indisoft solution on mobile devices. Indisoft Web Studio can integrate a multitude of devices and systems in different levels of the network, including micro, medium, and large PLCs, motion controllers, HMI panels, vision systems, and barcode and RFID readers. Indisoft Web Studio supports, for example, the hot standby redundant configuration, where just the primary server exchanges data with the devices in the plant floor, saves data into the history databases, and provides data to the thin client stations. If the primary server becomes unavailable, the secondary server automatically takes over the communication with the devices in the plant floor, saves data into the history databases, and provides data to the thin client stations. Furthermore, the thin clients can be connected to the servers through any TCP IP link, such as local area network, or even the internet. Indisoft's thin client solution is firewall friendly and does not require additional TCP ports other than the standard ports for the HTTP or HTTPS protocol.
Welcome to the Indusoft Web Studio demo presentation. I'll show you how easy it is to create HMI and SCADA applications with Indusoft Web Studio. And I'll demonstrate all the main features and unique capabilities in the product. First of all, after installing Indusoft Web Studio, you can launch the development environment just by double clicking on the Indusoft Web Studio icon created automatically on the desktop during installation. Then, if you want to start the runtime, all you have to do is click on this green icon to run the application. In this first screen, we can see one nice feature from Indusoft Web Studio called Screen Group. Even though it looks to the operator like there's just one screen open, we actually have three screens open at the same time. Up here, we have the uh, header on the top, and the menu on the left, and the main screen here in the center. If I want to change any of those screens, I can change them individually, and they do not affect each other. I can do that even during the runtime because we have online configuration. So, if I want to make a change on the header, that's all I have to do is switch to the development environment, select the graphics tab, screens, and then edit the header screen. Then I can do something simple just like uh, adding a rectangle and make it blink. For instance, uh, according to the system tag called blink slow. I save the change and as soon as I save the changes the development downloads the changes to the runtime which happens to be on the same computer but could be in a remote computer too. And the header screen is automatically updated so I do not have to shut down my runtime just to make those changes. I can do them on the fly. If I switch to any other screen Notice the header is always updated on the top. Because I can create the screens as frames, which again are called screen groups in Indusoft Web Studio. So, I do not have to redo this change over and over for screen combinations. Another nice feature of the Indusoft Web Studio is the event logger. So, when you create applications, you can configure the events that should be logged by the system. So, right here, Indusoft keeps a log of the event time, the event message, the action that was performed, the station from where the event was triggered, and the username logged on the system when the action took place. So, you can keep a log of all the commands, or at least the critical commands, triggered by the users and filter this information by event time, by message, by username, by station, and print this information or even save this data into reports in PDF format or any other format you might want to use. Talking about the main features of Indusoft, we provide all kinds of dynamics that you expect from HMI SCADA package such as bar graphs, color dynamic, to uh, change the color of any object based on a tag value. Text I.O. you can display or even allow the user to input data during the runtime. And Indusoft provides the virtual keyboards and virtual keypads so you can enter data uh, even in uh, touchscreen devices. Using the show on condition dynamic you can control the visibility of any object during the runtime based on uh, tag values or expressions. You can also rotate objects like lines, polygons, and control the size of objects dynamically or even the position of any object on the screen, dynamically based on tag values as well. Hyperlinks can be used to open up external documents, websites, emails, or any other document that you uh, might want to open from the application. provide uh, all kinds of commands like switches, buttons, radio buttons, checkboxes, and active objects from native uh, from Indusoft Web Studio, like for instance the combo box where the user can select one option given a set of options. The list box, which is used for the same purpose as the combo box, 
but uh, it allows you to display the options to the user even before he or she clicks on the object. The smart message can be used to display different messages even with different colors or different pictures based on tag values. And Indusoft provides all types of push buttons like momentary, maintained push buttons, and latch push buttons. The grid object is extremely powerful and at the same time very simple to use. The grid object can be used to display any kind of tabular format from different data sources which could be an array class tag, a text file, or even a database. For example, I can start Notepad here in my computer and create a simple text file like for instance we'll type machine A, machine B, and machine C. And I can save this information like for instance in the temp folder with uh, the name mydemo.csv. So I just created a simple CSV file, a text file in a CSV format, which could be created with Indusoft as well. If I wanted to display this information on the screen, all I have to do is open my screen or create a new screen, click on the grid object from the toolbar, and click and drag to create this object on the screen. Here in uh, data, I'll browse the file where I have the data that I want to display and the information can be changed dynamically during the runtime if I wanted to by creating a string tag between curly brackets in this field. And finally I give labels to the columns like uh, machine name, let's say production, where production is a number. And when I save the changes, Indusoft downloads the changes to the runtime and the runtime automatically retrieves the information from the file and displays the data to the user. If I want to change the values here, I can enter a different value like 45. And when I open the file again with Notepad, I have the updated uh, value in the file. So it's, it's that easy to read or write information to text files in CSV format. I could do something similar to databases as well. Indusoft supports all SQL Server, SQL relational databases like SQL Server, Access, Excel, Sybase, MySQL, and so on and so forth. So the same way I exchange data with SQL Server in this example, I could do in different database formats like Oracle, Sybase, and any other SQL relational database that provides uh, an ODBC driver or an ADO provider. So just to begin from scratch, I can create a brand new database in SQL Server, which could be created by Indusoft as well, but I want to do it from SQL Server to show that Indusoft can integrate data even to databases created by different systems like SAP, uh, Microsoft Dynamics, or any other system. So, I give a name to the database like my demo, and in a few seconds, I have the new database in SQL Server. And here I can create a new table. Let's uh, create a table, for instance, with uh, some data like machine, uptime, downtime, and where uptime and downtime are numeric values. I can save this table, for instance, with the name OEE, and just to make a quick demo, I can populate this uh, table with some data like, like A, B, and C. And obviously the table could have been created in Indusoft and even populated by Indusoft. I'm uh, done here in SQL Server. If I want to display the information in Indusoft, again, all I have to do is create a grid object. And now I can link Indusoft to that database. To do that, I can go to Project Settings, 
Options, Default Database, and here Indusoft displays all the providers to different databases available in this computer. Like, for instance, Oracle, or the JET provider to Microsoft Access or Excel. And here I have the provider for SQL Server, which is the database I'm using in this example. I can browse different server in my network. In this case, I'm using my local server. Uh, I'm going to use the operated, Operating System Integrated Security. Select My Demo, the database I just created to test and test the connection to make sure the connection is successful. I'm done here now. So uh, now in the grid object, all I have to do is change the data source to database instead of text file. Here in data, I can select the table from the database I want to retrieve information from. In this case, the table OEE. And here in columns, I can give labels to the columns. And uh, if the field name matches the label name, I don't have to fill in the field column here. Resize the object. Uh, make sure I have enough room to display the information that I want. And then I save the changes. Now, when I run the application again, Indusoft connects to the database and displays the data on the screen. Just like in the text file, just like in the text file, if I uh, click on a cell and I want to change the value, like 89, uh, enter. Indusoft writes this data back to the database. And if I open the table in SQL Server, I have the updated value there. So it's that easy to save and retrieve data from any SQL relational database, including Microsoft SQL Server. This is uh, just a very simple and basic demonstration, but you can create very sophisticated reports and integrations to uh, databases. Reading data from different ERP systems and feeding the ERP systems with uh, the information that Indusoft retrieves from anywhere on the plant floor, from PLCs, motion controllers, vision systems, and so on and so forth. And all of those features are supported not only on the desktop running Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 2008 server, but also on mobile devices running Windows Mobile or Industrial HMIs running Windows CE. Indusoft is also an ActiveX container, so it can host any third-party ActiveX and display information of this ActiveX on the screen. You can read uh, properties, set properties, run events, or even execute functions based on events triggered by the ActiveX. And Indusoft is a .NET container as well. So, just like ActiveX, you can insert .NET controls on the screen and interact with the .NET controls as well. Indusoft provides a built-in module to handle recipes. It's uh, very simple to configure. You pretty much define here the tags you want to save in this recipe and the recipe name which can be changed dynamically during the runtime. And during the runtime I can load recipes, uh, here in this case recipes in XML format automatically created by Indusoft. And if I open the recipe file I can see this kind of web report and if I view the source it's an actual XML file automatically created by Indusoft. So, the main advantage is that you do not have to know anything about XML to create applications in XML format or even save and retrieve data in XML format. Indusoft provides an embedded tool to generate reports as well. So, in this demo, I can save reports in text format or in RTF format, rich text format. But uh, also from Indusoft, it's possible to save reports in different formats like HTML and PDF as well. If you want to change the report, 
It's as simple as editing the report here in the Indusoft Report Writer. And I can add here, for instance, my demo. And I want to display the value of the tag time. So I use the syntax with the tag name between curly brackets to display the tag value on the report. And I can edit the color, save it, and now during the runtime, when I save the report, I have the updated report on the screen. In this demo, I'm going to use those buttons to create uh, reports, but uh, in the real world, you can configure the scheduler module from Indusoft uh, to create reports automatically, for instance. Uh, once a shift, once an hour, once a day, once a month, retrieving data from the databases uh, from different data sources and even use the built-in functions from Indusoft to send emails with the reports uh, attached to the emails automatically. All of the uh, history tasks from Indusoft like events history, alarm history, trend history can save and retrieve data from any SQL relational database like SQL Server, Oracle, Sybase, MySQL, uh, Microsoft Access, Excel, and any other database that supports an ODBC driver or an ADO provider. And I'll demonstrate how to use those tasks in the following examples. Indusoft provides a complete set of tools for trending. So the trend object is a very simple uh, to configure object but at the same time a very complete and flexible object. It can save, uh, it can display data from different data sources including databases, online tags, text files. Um, Indusoft can display trends based on time or X and Y uh, curves. Uh, you can change the look and feel of the pens even during the runtime. For instance, I can change this pen to be orange and I want to change here the thickness. So I can change the look and feel of the pen on the fly. And in real systems, you can define a look and feel for what we call a normal state and a different color and look and feel for out of limits. So when this pen is out of limits that you specify during the project configuration, like for instance, alarm limits, the color and the look and feel of the pen changes only on the sections where the value is out of limit. So, it could be, for instance, red for the values out of limit for this pen. And I can uh, zoom in and zoom out of the object. I can select, I can have uh, all the pens sharing the X and Y axis. Uh, I'm sorry, all of the Y axis. Or I can split the, the channels between different Y axis here. I can pause the object and I can use the scroll bar to visualize the data from the past or even select here from the built-in calendar any date and time from the past and Indusoft automatically retrieves the information from the history files and displays the data to the user. I can also add pens uh, on the fly even in the online mode or remove pens on the fly even uh, during the runtime mode. By default, in this example, Indusoft is saving and retrieving data from proprietary history files. They're pretty much uh, binary flat files with the history data. If uh, I want to save this information to an external database, which again could be Oracle, SQL Server, or any SQL relational database, all I have to do is change the history from proprietary to database and here in the database configuration define the name of the table where I want to save the data. In this case I'll keep the default name trend001 and I'll ask Indusoft to create the table automatically. When I save those changes Indusoft saves the data to the new database and the object automatically retrieves the data from the new database instead of retrieving the data from the proprietary file. So, you do not have to change the screen at all. You just modify the task to save to whatever database you want to use. I'll go back to SQL Server. 
And here in the tables, I can see the table trend 001 created by Indusoft. And if I open this table, I have a lot of data, a lot of records appended automatically by Indusoft Web Studio with the timestamp here and the values of the tags configured in the trend worksheet. So again, it's that simple to save and retrieve data, even history data from the remote databases or from SQL relational databases. In addition to the trending features, Indusoft also provides a complete set of tools for alarm management. Everything is embedded in the product. You do not have to install different add-ons or different product types to use those features. So I can simulate some alarms here like digital alarms or analog alarms and when the user acknowledges the alarm he has the option to enter a comment which uh, is one of the requirements for the FDA 21 CFR Part 11. And by the way, Indusoft Web Studio provides all the tools that you need to create applications compliant with 21 CFR Part 11. So I can enter a comment here like I was not here and when I say OK, Indusoft acknowledges the alarm and saves this comment to the history file. So, if I switch here to history mode, I can see all the information about the alarms, including comments, the usernames, the date and time when the alarm happened, and when uh, the alarm was acknowledged, you, eventually when the alarm is normalized, and you can filter on this information based on date, time, group, priority, or any way you want and you can either print this information or save the filtered alarms to PDF reports or different types of reports. In addition to that, when uh, you configure the alarms in the Indusoft Web Studio development environment, you can enable the option to send emails automatically. So whenever any alarm from this group becomes active, the email addresses configured in this dialog or receive alarm notifications. So if you are able to receive emails on your Blackberry or any other mobile device you can receive online no alarm notification through emails generated automatically by Indusoft Web Studio. Indusoft provides uh, more than 240 communication drivers for different protocols and all the drivers are installed along with the product. Indusoft uh, provides also a translation tool embedded in any license of the product. So you can design your application in one language and during the runtime switch the language to any other idiom including Chinese and Japanese because Indusoft is Unicode compliant so any text displayed by Indusoft can be translated to different languages. And the way it works is when you finish the development of your application, you can use Indusoft to export all the text in your entire application to a CSV file. A translator, a different person, can then open up the CSV file, for instance, in Excel and add the translations to different columns of Excel so that each column in Excel can hold a specific language like German, Portuguese, Spanish, French, Chinese, and Japanese. And during the runtime, all you have to do is set Indusoft to a specific column number in the CSV file, and all the text with translation available in this file will automatically be translated during the runtime. And the nice thing here is uh, when you use the thin client solution, uh, each thin client could be running its own language simultaneously. Uh, so you could, for example, have the server running in English, one web thin client running in Chinese, and another web thin client running in uh, Spanish. Everything at the same time. By the way, talking about web solution, 
I have this application running on the server and if I want to visualize this application from a remote computer all I have to do is open Internet Explorer type in the IP address of my computer the name of the screen I want to open and it asks for username and password if I do not type a valid username and password I have no access whatsoever to the application if I uh, do enter a valid username and password the thin client the, uh, the web browser connects to the server and displays the application from the server for, uh, on the web thin client Notice that uh, you do not have to worry about the resolution on the web thin client because Indusoft automatically scales the screen to fit the resolution available on the web thin client station. All of the features I have on the server can be visualized on the web thin client as well. The uh, web thin client can not only visualize data but also input data and send the information back to the server unless you create uh, restrictions to do that for security reasons um, using the built-in security system as possible uh, but there are no limitations from the technology point of view everything that the operator sees and does on the server he can see and do from the web thin client station so even the changes I implemented uh, on the application on the server like the rectangle on the header the grid object to display the information from text files or from databases everything is available on the web thin client the same way is available on the server so I do not have to redesign the screens or even recompile the screens to make them available to the web thin client all the features including trending online trend history alarm online alarm history, everything is available from the server is also available on the web thin client. In combining those tools you can even create web reports like this, in, uh, like this example. Uh, retrieving data from the database, combi combining this data with uh, online information that Indusoft reads from controllers, from the PLCs, from the operator, and, and uh, create this kind of dashboard or OEE report where uh, the supervisor or the operator all the way up to the CEO can select data retrieve statistical information or online data directly from Indusoft Web Studio and this information can be visualized from any computer available on the network as long as you have a valid TCP IP link to the server but it's not necessary to install Indusoft Web Studio or even a license on the web thin client all you need is regular Internet Explorer web browser. There are uh, many nice features in Indusoft Web Studio, and Indusoft keeps evolving the product and providing new capabilities to its customers. But to focus on this presentation, these are just the main features and options that I wanted to show you. I, uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any questions, do not hesitate to contact Indusoft. Uh, thank you very much uh, for watching this presentation, and have a nice day.